One of the immediate disappointments of the cancellation of the college athletic year was the loss of a home NCAA tournament appearance for the U of A women's basketball team. News 4 Tucson's David Kelly spoke to Wildcats head coach Adia Barnes today about the abrupt ending to Arizona's dream season. The last day was the hardest moment I've had coaching. And that's because Adia Barnes just could not believe it was true, could not believe the NCAA would actually cancel the tournament. Her one word tweet that day said it all. But the devastation had actually started days before, before the tournament had even been canceled. I was devastated at first because I heard that we were going to play without fans. An unthinkable situation considering a raucous Wildcat Nation was a large reason the team was where they were to begin with. So that was the first part. I was like, we've worked so hard to play at home. The whole purpose of playing at home is to sell out McHale and have 15,000 fans. But it was a sobering reality when Athletic Director Dave Hickey delivered the news and Barnes had to gather her team. That was hard. I, it was hard because I didn't want to cry because I knew it was an emotional time. and. And I kept myself together, and then our uh, my boss, Susie, <laughs> comes down and talks about it, and she shed a tear, then it was over after that. Over for a senior class who had taken Arizona higher than they'd been in 15 years. We exceeded everybody's expectations in the country. So I think I, I was just heartbroken for the Lucias that came here when our program was awful, for the Dominics that transferred wanting to win, for Mari, who had never been to a tournament. Like, those things were hard. And although the upcoming season remains unclear due to COVID-19, it's Barnes's feeling there will be basketball in November and with fans in the stands. We've got you covered here at McHale Center. I'm David Kelly, News 4, Tucson.